In this video, I will show you how to design a simple flow model in Communications Orchestrator. To do this, you must be logged on as a user with permissions to create flow models. This simple flow model I will create consists of three nodes. One input channel that receives input data and triggers the flow model. One communication that creates documents. And one output channel that delivers the output from the flow model. In the web client, I navigate to the orchestration asset library. To add a new flow model, I click add and select flow model. Here I enter a name and a description, which is quite convenient when dealing with a large amount of resources, and click create. I then select to open the flow model. In the flow model I just added, I drag out an input channel node to the stage area, a communication, and an output channel. I also connect the nodes like this. To the right you have the node properties where you can select among the available types for the channels and communications. For the input channel I select HTTP in in this example. For the communication I select letter 2 and for the output I select file output channel and then I save the changes. Be sure to watch the other videos in this series.